<laughs> All right, we ready? Come on, make some noise. We're in the hour. Ladies and gentlemen, this next man I've known for over 20 years, one of my best friends. And let me tell you something. His farts are so bad that they've actually taken at least five years off of my life. Ladies and gentlemen, Don Jameson. <laughs> Recording a live CD tonight, so laugh it up, have a good time. <laughs> Try not to look at the serial killer in the front row. <laughs> if your eyes don't meet his, you're gonna make it out alive tonight. Just we got any fans of that metal show in the house? <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate you watching the show. Uh, we just got good news today. Uh, we found out that metal show. It's the longest running show in VH1 history, so thank you very much. Which is kind of like being the smartest one on Here Comes Honey Boo Boo. It's like being the most handsome one on Duck Dynasty. No offense, sir. I'm such a metal fan, I told my girlfriend if we ever get married, I want our wedding song to be ACDC, Highway to Hell. She said, oh yeah, you know what our honeymoon song's gonna be? Shot Down in Flames. I said, oh yeah, you ever hear that Guns N' Roses song? I used to love her, and I had to kill her. I love Guns N' Roses, man. One of the most hardcore bands that ever lived is Guns N' Roses, right? Any Guns fans in there? You don't have to do a golf clap, it's an album. Let's, you know, do a whole clap. I'm not fucking Tiger Woods trying to get a birdie on the 16th hole. I'm trying to make an album. You're not in the fucking gallery. You don't have to be polite. Right, when they were recording their first album, Appetite for Destruction, they were so poor, they actually all lived together in a storage unit in Los Angeles. Pretty hardcore, right, dude? Right. That's why I wish they had that show Storage Wars on the air back then. <laughs> Imagine that, I'd be $1,300 for that unit. I got two groupies, three pounds of heroin, and guns and fucking roses, man. See a guy wheeling Slash behind him on one of those hand cards. The guy next to him's all pissed off because he bit twice as much as the other unit, and he got fucking Mumford and Sons. 